Audio description to Ben Rushgrove. The Bournemouth University logo. Changing attitudes, Ben Rushgrove. A Paralympic perspective, Paralympic sprinter. The UK Disability Month logo. Ben Rushgrove, Paralympian athlete, has come to speak at Bournemouth University, providing his perspective on disability sport, in support of Disability History Month and the university's outreach work. Ben speaks to an audience in a lecture theatre. He picks up two Paralympic medals. My name's Ben Rushgrove. Um, I competed in uh, Beijing and London. <laughs> um, and... Uh, and I want you some medals, and I'd like to share them with you. Uh, so pass them around, please. Ben hands the medals to the front row. Uh, don't be frightened. Uh, they're not going to, you know... Uh, I, I, we're sitting at the dining table just now, and someone's having this horror story about this head teacher who was standing there with a the medal, he fell over or something and broke the medal. So, you know, just stay seated, it'll be fine. Um. <laughs> Audience passes medals around. I won the silver medal with a broken foot in Beijing. Uh, my foot was broken in two places. Uh, so that kind of makes it all the more remarkable, if that makes sense. It, it's a fascinating thing whenever you get a Paralympic Games because everybody who's there is disabled. Audience and, listens intently. As a consequence, the facilities and everything are made out to be incredibly accessible for disabled people. Um, the reality is that uh, most of the time, although the facilities in this little tiny bubble, if you like, are accessible, anything outside of the bubble is a real problem. Audience concentrates hard. There's a lot of questions about legacy of games after every game. And uh, the reality is that actually not a lot changes. It's a, stra it's a strange thing it is. You know, people's mindset changes quite quickly, I think. You know, but then they quickly revert back to the way things were before as well. I don't know how many of you heard this week that the government have decided to cut the independent living allowance for disabled people. Um, and that will have a real impact on the lives of disabled people. It will mean that they don't get to go out and about as much in the local community. You know, the reality is, is that what that independence grant allowed them to do is it allowed them to pay for for transportation to get them out and about. That was, the, that was the nature of the grant. You take that away and what they got left, you know? There are some things that have really improved as a result of the Paralympics. People come up to me certainly much more confidently than they did before the Games. And they're quite happy to talk to me and, and I'm quite happy to talk to whoever, you know? And, and that's, it's, it's a, that kind of that interaction, you know, that kind of awkward moment has kind of gone a bit. Screen shows Ben with medals. To learn more about the dignity, diversity and equality work at Bournemouth University, visit www.bournemouth.ac.uk forward slash diversity. To hear more about Ben, visit www.benrushgrove.com. On Twitter, Ben is at brushgrove.